Good morning, soon-to-be graduates. Congratulations, 2019. Um, just a few things to go over with you because you've just received a letter in Homeroom that explained that the Monroe Township Board of Education has decided to allow you to keep your devices beyond graduation. They are your devices starting June 20th. So we have to go over a few things to show you how to back up your information and set up your Chromebook account. On the letter from Mr. Capello stating that you're able to keep your devices, you flip that over, it says important information seen your devices on the back. You have to do a few things. You're going to have to set up a personal Gmail account in order to use your Chromebook in the future. You may choose to back up your data, which is the bulk of what I'll go over at this time. And then on June 21st, you just have to shut down your Chromebook a few times, and that will release it from our system and put it into your own control. So what I'm really going to focus on is this piece right here. The Google Drive has to be backed up. So if there's anything that you want from your time in high school, perhaps a resume or something that you could use again in the future, you're going to need to save that now. You could simply download it to your device if it's only one or two items, but if you'd like to save your entire drive, this will walk you through that process. When you click on this link, or in your case type it in, it will take you to the Google Account Help. Google Account Help is a really useful place to go for anything to go with your Chromebook in the future, so this one's just going to deal with copying files. Before you copy anything, you need to make sure that you've created an outside Gmail account. They are free. It is your choice. I set one up here just as a mock account so that you could see how it looks on your end. But once you're into that copy content from your school, you've created an account, take a second to look over your files. Maybe you don't need to save that do now from three years ago forever in your new drive. You can simply delete that. Once you've prepared all of your files and you've decided you're ready to copy, now you go on to this transfer your content piece. When you click on it, it's going to ask for the destination account, which is your outside account, the account that you're going to use after high school, no longer affiliated with Williamstown. So you're going to have to send a code. From there, your Gmail will get a code that you have to enter in at this point. So it'll ask to verify your account. You'll have to click get the code, copy it, and paste it into this piece. Click verify, and it will say, okay, your account is ready to be copied over. So now I'm gonna copy from my Monroe Township account over to my new personal Gmail account. You can save your Gmail if you use something like that, um, but for the most part, that wasn't enabled in your time here at Williamstown. The part that you really want to save are your drive files. So make sure that that button is toggled on, click Start Transfer, and it will send all of your content over. It does take some time. You'll get an email when it's complete. But you need to make sure that you have that process completed by June 20th. So you may want to take some time right now while you're waiting to go out to the senior picnic and back up anything that you'd like. If you have any questions, you have until June 20th to come and see Mrs. Carullo in the Library Media Center. After that, we do not offer support on these devices. So I encourage you to use the Google Help Center for anything that you need help with dealing with your Chromebook. Thank you for your time and congratulations.